This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up straight after this TFNN midday update. The Dow is down 228 to 26,276. Went all the way down to the left side low of 26,062. Just took it out at 26,033. Tried to rally. It's running beautifully off the low, but still down 270, uh, sorry, 227 points. Lower lows, lower highs, that's what we're looking at since the 23rd of, they can't be um, March, that should be April. Yeah, April high, let me just change that before. Uh, here we go, Four. there we go. And uh, the upside resistance now is at 26,290 to 26,340. The uh, Let's go to the S&P, the S&P is also down quite sharply, it's actually down uh, 0.92, the Dow's only down 0.80. The S&P is down at 29.18, made a lower low on the left side. Remember those H patterns that we always talk about? Well, it took out the left side low, but it's above that right now. It's down 27 at 29.18. Uh, the resistance is now at 29, I would say 23 to 25. And the support is at, uh, well, it better not take out today's low in the next two days. Otherwise, that'll be very poor action. QQQ, the NDX 100 trading vehicle, nice bounce off the low. The low today is at 186.76. The high that was made, the all-time high on the 28th of April was 191.32. Consolidation up in the higher range. But any break below 80, 186 in the next two days would be very negative. I'm not sure what will do that, but it certainly could happen. The day's young. I think we might have even made an intraday high. We'll see whether or not that holds uh, we can take out that high, or we start to take out some support in the in the market. And the IWM is really fabulous. So over the weekend, I said to subscribers, this is the index that might be rotating. And I had an interview over the weekend, and that was my my pick was the IWM could very well hold a lot better than the other indices since it was the laggard, and laggards these days seem to suddenly find favor. It is right now. It's only down 54 cents at 159.97. Gold attempted to rally. It's only up 0.8 right now, and the dollar is holding really well after a very good week last week, and we're looking at it at 97.58. I'll be back. We'll talk about crude oil, interest rates, and many other things in my show coming straight up next few minutes stay tuned otherwise i'll see you tomorrow have a great day